um, use Mr. Clean Spray to clean the window. Actually, this works great. If we're going to put a, a highlighted window vent here, I think we should clean the window. Good call. <laughs> Much better. This window bench is going to be so cute. I love how we're reusing this. Well, this was a day bed, and yeah. I bought a coffee table at a thrift store. Now, the most important part, of course, is to make sure we have stability. Yeah. When I was hunting for this table, I sat on it, I shook it. Did it's you stand on it and uh, jump up and down? Because they're kids, you A know. little bit. Well, the important part is to make sure it's solid wood, not something like particle board, no then glass. Then it fall apart. Don't want it falling apart. And you know what? When you're constructing it together, sometimes you have to be creative with the stability. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put some little wedges back here so that this is really sturdy again. We want to withstand the kids. Yeah, that makes perfect sense. Now, with the shape of this, the reason I really liked this is because the shape was going to be interesting. That's why I took this piece from the daybed. And whenever you're repurposing something into something else, always look at the shape of it. You know, Something if, unexpected exactly. is what I always like to we say. We could have used a wagon wheel that back here. That would be here. so cute. Yeah, just something with an interesting shape is a great way to make a unique piece of furniture. And this? With this being the high point, I think if we center it under the window, when you come in, your eye will go up and mm -hmm. it'll draw the light in and uh, and paint. So what yes. are we doing paint-wise? It's really fun to pick a crazy color. Now we yes. picked a simple color here, white, sure. but if you're doing this at home, you can pick any crazy color you have. If you've got a lime green throw pillow, how fun! paint something lime green. Don't, don't be afraid of color. And don't forget, it's so important, and I know we did it here, if you're not going to sand everything, and this is really hard in detail mm -hmm. to sand, just throw on some primer and the paint will stick right to it. This is going to be fantastic.